All right, let's get started. Today we're gonna have a jail building competition. A contest between you and me? Sounds fun! Well, the only rule is that both of us have to construct our own prisons. Then we'll take turns trying to escape from each other's jails. How exciting! I'm getting started right now! Alright, cool. I'll build mine over here, and you can build yours there. Yeah! This space should be good. Let's begin. Time to build the best prisons we can! I'm fired up! Let's do this. I should start with the basics and build off of that. A cell would be a good place to start. How about 15 blocks wide? I'll make the ceiling nice and high. That'll be good. Let's see. Okay, there! Oh, Mikey's is coming along nicely. I wonder what kind of prison he's building. I should focus on my own prison for now. That means no peeking. This is the foundation to my awesome project. I need to work super hard and really make it my own. Like this. Nice. It looks like a good start. I'll place it here. Yeah, that's it. Cool. This is going to be the big cell Mikey starts in here. The bars go all the way to the ceiling. Nice. Now I need to decorate it like a prison room. I can't leave it empty. Cells need beds. Maybe like this. No, I don't think so. It doesn't look right. Maybe another bed? Yeah, like a bunk bed. Yep, that looks great. I'll place a ladder so we can reach the top bunk. It also needs a toilet and stuff. I guess that can go over here. Hmm, that should work. Of course, he needs a sink to wash his hands and brush his teeth. That's pretty much everything I can think of. It's a little empty, but it's still a jail cell. Even though this is a prison, there's supposed to be a way for Mikey to get out. For his escape route, I'm going to use vents. They should be up high, near the ceiling, so it's a little difficult to get into. I don't want to make it too easy. Okay. After crawling into the vent, I'll have to lead it back around this way. Then it'll connect through here. Yeah, this should work perfectly. I mapped out the ventilation shaft. Nice. I guess I'll make the top out of iron too. That should work. This is really coming along. The vent looks great. Now I'll line the sides, just like that. Nice! Okay, that's it! The very first part of the escape route is complete. With that built and ready, I just need to put in a vent cover. Looks good. You come in just like that? All right, it's perfect. Now then, we need to think of a way to get up to the vent. A ladder is too easy. Maybe a simple parkour course? Let's see. There we go. You have to lift each trapdoor manually. Uh, oh, I guess not. You can climb them when they're closed too. Works for me. The trick is to climb up the trap doors, then once you get to the vent entrance, you can squeeze inside and work your way through to the rest of the vent. Pretty tricky, huh? Now it's time for me to design an exit on the other side. How should it look? Maybe a trap door? Oh, sweet! You can see through the glass. You stand on it, then you pop it open and drop through to make your escape. This seems like a pretty good first obstacle. The first section is done. Now I need to figure out the next part of my prison. I definitely want more parkour. Lava parkour. <laughs> First, I need to build this wall. Almost done. 
a little more. There we go. It's all sectioned off now. Once you escape from this room, you can open a door over here. This is the next section of the prison escape. Welcome to the most intense lava parkour area you've ever seen. Uh, one second. Hang on. Yes! Now the entire floor is covered with lava. Next, I'll start building the parkour section. Don't want it to be too easy. One slip and it's all over for Mikey. He needs to be careful. How's this? Yeah, this looks really good. A few more. I'll put the last platform along here. He'll climb up here to safety. After that, he's in the clear. Let me try it out. Hey, this is pretty fun. Well, that does it for part two of the prison escape route, the lava parkour room. Once Mikey makes it through, he's gonna have a brand new obstacle to get past. I'll start it from up here. Oh, I see what Mikey's doing. Looks like he's making something with lava too. I don't want to ruin the big surprise, so I'll focus on my own build. I need to put some walls up around this walkway. Hmm. How's that? Perfect. I want to launch Mikey really high. I think 50 blocks is good. Terrific! Once you make it through the lava parkour, you can climb this ladder into the next section. Now it's time to build an actual escape mechanism, the TNT elevator. I'm gonna need a lot of explosives for this plan to work. I'll put the TNT dispensers all around the room, like this, in a big circle. Okay. Yes, looking good. I'll put one slab in the middle and then fill the rest of the hole with water. There we go. Now it's time to outline everything with redstone dust. I'll complete the redstone circuit with a button here. That should do it for the TNT elevator. It'll launch Mikey up crazy high in the air. Whoa, nice! Let's move on. I'll start making the next area of the prison from all the way up here. I wonder what it should be. I better clear this out. Works for me. Great. I guess I should leave some golden apples here. That way, it'll be easier for Mikey to survive the TNT elevator. Nice! It'll launch you into the next room. For this one, I'll have Mikey choose between three paths. I'll build a wall around here. 
Once that's done, I'll set up three buttons on the wall. A wooden button, an iron button, and last but not least, a gold button. Only one of them will lead Mikey to the next stage. The other two are bad news. You wouldn't want to push those. <laughs> I'll start by building the bad ones first. If he pushes this one, the floor will disappear and he'll have a nasty fall. Hmm... Let's see... What trap will I use? Oh, I have an idea! I need to place a repeater first. That should do it! If you push the button, it'll activate a command that turns the wooden planks into thin air, causing Mikey to drop down below. But that's not all. I can't let him off that easily. His punishment will need to be more serious than that, so I'll need him to survive the fall. I'm gonna line the floor with slime so that Mikey doesn't take any fall damage. Just a little bit more. There we go. That should be enough slime for now. You can fall without taking any damage. Now for the real punishment. It's gonna be something awful. I'll start from up here. This'll take a second. Next, I need to extend a redstone circuit. This will connect the command block to the rest of the track. There we go. It'll activate exactly one second after Mikey falls. Right here. I'm gonna spawn a whole bunch of zombies. That means I'll need to use a special command. I'll try this. Summon zombie 141247520. That command should work perfectly for my evil plans. I'll go ahead and enter it into the command block here, and then I'll set it to repeat. Time to test it out. If you push the wooden button up here, the floor will drop out from underneath you like this. And after a second... Whoa! Zombies! A whole army of them! Wait, why does it look like they're dying? I guess I messed up the circuit. I'll fix it. How about this? Yeah, that should work. Now, if you press the button, the floor vanishes and a big horde of living zombies appear. As soon as Mikey falls down, he won't stand a chance. Tough break. Okay, that should do it for punishment. For now, I'll use a command to clear out all these zombies. Nice! The wooden button trap is officially finished. Hooray! I'll patch this up real quick. I think the iron button will be the correct choice, so I'll need to make a trap for the gold button. I'll move it over by one block. Let's make the floor out of gold blocks. It looks cool. My plan is to install another command block similar to the last one. The gold blocks will disappear from under you and you'd fall into another trap. This time, I want to try something a little different. When you fall into the gold trap, I want pain to rain down from above. Time to design the nastiest punishment ever. Let's do it! First, I need to cover this whole room with obsidian. Why do I want it to have an obsidian coating? Just wait and see. I wonder if some of you have figured it out already. All I need to do is enter a simple command and I can convert this entire section into obsidian. Whoops, I got stuck on the wrong side of the wall. There we go. Finally, all the walls are obsidian. Time to get started on the ceiling. I wouldn't want it to break. This part of the trap is going really well. Looks like I'm almost ready. Can you tell what I'm planning on doing with all this obsidian? Here's a hint. Obsidian is the only material strong enough to withstand TNT. Okay, I'm almost done coating this entire room. It's just the floor that's left. Nice! What I want to do now is layer the entire floor with TNT. I want to pack every square inch of this dungeon with explosives. This will be the biggest kaboom you've ever seen! If you push the gold button, you'll drop into an explosive nightmare. Now I'm worried about Mikey. 
Is this too harsh? I need to make sure that everything works. Great. Now it's time for the most important part of the plan. Installing the dispensers. I'll line them up in a row like that. Next, I'll need to load them up with fire charges. The dispensers will launch the fire charges that will ignite the TNT and lead to a massive explosion. Now that everything's loaded, let's take a look at how it'll go down. The fire charges will come up from here and drop down to the floor. It's too much work to test it out, so I'll just have to hope for the best. I'll place it like this. Then I'll set up the circuit. If I wire it like this, then it should work. I think I got it. All right, the redstone circuit is complete. If you press this button, a stream of fire charges will rain down and ignite the TNT. Looks good. The gold button trap is finished. Now for the final button. This one has to be the correct choice. I need to figure out what to do with this iron button. Maybe some kind of reward. I'll make the floor iron so it matches the button. Next, a command block. Okay. I set the command to remove the iron blocks. This time, Mikey will fall all the way down to the ground level. It's a straight drop to the bottom. There, I've made it into one big, long pipe. I just need to block it off. I know, I'll make it into a water slide. That's the reward for choosing correctly. I think he's really gonna love this. Let's see. It'll look something like this. I'll stop the water for now. Whoa, Mikey's prison is epic. Looks like the competition is heating up. This is a lot of fun. I'm just gonna try my best. You can splash your way down the water slide like this. All right. There, sweet. There we go. Let's test it. When you push the iron button, you fall down and land in a big water slide. Then you ride it down to the bottom here. Now I need to think about what goes in the next area. Hmm. For the next obstacle, I think I'll design a trap where you have to run away from an enemy. This might take a minute. Okay. Nice. Once you reach the bottom of the slide, I'll leave a real tough enemy waiting to chase Mikey. I think I'll put him over here. This looks good. Just around the corner. Now then, which enemy should I use? How about this guy? He'll be the last obstacle of the prison. He's super strong, really fast, and he's got a whole lot of health. There's absolutely no way to beat him. Mikey shouldn't even try. There's no use in fighting back either, so don't even bother. He's the ultimate zombie, one of the strongest enemies in the game. And that's why you have to start sprinting the second you get off the water slide, like this. You know what? I think I can make this even tougher with lasers. That way, you have to jump over the laser beams while you run away. There we go. These are tricky. You jump, dodge, Hey, hey, I did it! I don't want this to be too easy. Hmm, let's put in one you can't jump over. If you try, you'll get zapped. You just run straight through. Over here, you have to jump a certain way. This ain't no walk in the park. All right, it's time to make the exit. 
Since the zombie is taller than normal, I'll make the door two blocks high. If Mikey can make it to the end, he can pass through safely without being followed. Wow, we're almost done! I'll finish it with a cool door. Next, I want to make a super simple maze. There! For the walls, I'm gonna stick with leaf blocks. Mikey should get through it okay, just as long as he doesn't get turned around and lost. If he made it through everything else, this should be easy. How's that? There. Is this good? I'll put a dead end here. Okay, if Mikey is smart and uses a maze strategy, this should be a cakewalk for him. One last look. Nice! Now, when Mikey gets to the end, there should be a prize. He loves prizes. I'll put the chest over here, but what should be inside? Something cool. Oh, I'll give him an alien blaster rifle. This thing is insanely powerful. After all, it's made from super advanced alien technology. <laughs> Check it out. It's time to set up the final boss. If Mikey beats him, he'll be free. Let's see. Hmm. The doors for final bosses are supposed to be unique, right? I'll make these ones big and scary. There, that's good. Grab the treasure, open the door, then fight the boss in one last battle. I have the perfect boss for Mikey, a clown. If Mikey beats the clown, then he can break out of the prison. This'll be the way out over here. I'll put in a big garage door. Okay. That's perfect. If you defeat the clown, he get out of jail. I'm almost finished. I think a final boss room should be scarier. I'll line the walls with lava. Looks good. It is the final battle after all. Sweet! My prison is complete. I wonder how Mikey's doing. Well then, I'm going first in this challenge. I'm gonna try and break out of Mikey's prison. I got this. Let's go! So this is what you've been working on. Looks like fun. Try to break out. First, I need to break out of this cell, right? Can you do it? I can't open this door. It's made out of iron. Yep. And I can't jump over it either. Unless... Try it. Yeah. Oh. Aw, I almost made it. Good try. What's the trick here? Hmm. The furnace is empty. <laughs> Oh, hang on. I found something. Huh? What did you find? There's a chest hidden underneath the bed. What? How did you find that so fast? You can't reach it though, right? Huh? That's awesome. I got a lever. Nice. Well, great job. Yeah. You may have gotten out of your cell, but it's not over yet. I'll use the lever to open the door. Hey, I escaped my cell. There's a lot left though. Yeah, if you go this way, there's goodies for you! And your freedom. Hmm, it's lava parkour. This is a... Oh no! Wait, hang on! I did... Oh! I burned up fast. I'll try again. Watch out for the lava. I'll be careful. Here I go. Whoa! Made it. Nice! But I still died in the lava once. I can't get too confident. Am I supposed to head there next? You got it! Up on top? I know what this is. It's slime, right? Yeah! Boing! Wow. These trampolines are taking me to the top. Impressive! Oh! Oh, nice! There's a chest up here. Open! Oh, there are cookies and a full set of iron armor. Cool! I should equip this now. Wow, you look awesome! Thanks! Hey, I see husks in front of me. What do I do? That's up to you. But your armor should protect you, right? I mean, that's true, but... Whoa! I got knocked off! Go, husks! Stop the prisoner! 
tough. Yep. These levels are pretty challenging. Don't let him go! I wonder if I'm supposed to jump over the husk. Huh? Watch this. Oh no! Whoa! Ah, the husk! That scared me. One of them got knocked off. Aw, poor guy. I ate all the cookies. Oh. Like this, right? Okay, I'll jump over the husks, then shut the door behind me. Oh no! The baby husk made it through! It's chasing me! That's bad! Well, hey! It ran right through the gate! Stop! Seriously! I need to knock it over the edge! Okay. Wow, I survived. That was tough! Keep going, JJ! I'm impressed, Mikey. I made it safely through the husk area. Unfortunately, I took some damage. Let's see what's next. A choice. A diamond pickaxe or... Hmm. Or a wooden shovel? Obviously, I would choose the diamond pickaxe. That's what I thought. But something doesn't feel right. Why? Is that a trap chest? <gasps> I see your tricks. You're bluffing. I'll grab the diamond pickaxe and run away. Oh, you took it. Ah, I didn't fall for your trap. Bummer. I can't believe that worked. But this side is probably safer. I'll go this way. Oh, it's a diamond shovel. Aww. Am I supposed to dig my way through here? Yeah, can you do it? Huh? I hit a wall already. It's obsidian. Oh, is that so? I think I get it now. I figured it out. Really? It's a maze. Seriously? Do you think you're gonna find your way out? I made it through. Whoa. Sweet. Is that all? No. Nope. Oh. You aced it. Yeah, now... No! Oh! Thank goodness there was water there. That was close. I need to watch out. You got this. This baby husk has been following me. Careful! Bam. There. I took care of him once and for all. Now what's this, Mikey? A door and a chest? Can I open them? That's what they're there for. I wonder what's inside. Whoa, what a haul! Thanks, Mikey! Yeah! Golden apples! <laughs> no way! A full set of diamond armor? Now I'm ready for anything! Are you? Woohoo! What else is there? Am I almost free? You're close! Really close! There's just one more thing! Here goes nothing! Huh? Wait! Is this the final boss? What do you think? Vindicators? I'm in serious trouble! Get him! They don't stand a chance against me with my diamond sword! My final gun! Attack! Stop the prisoner from escaping! Huh? Booyah! I beat them! Nice! You're strong, JJ! Does this mean I'm free? What's over there? Open! Your prize! Whoa, look at all this treasure! A lever and a stack of diamonds and emeralds! Wow! Congrats! I can use this lever to open the door. I escaped your prison! Yeah! Well done! That was a lot of fun, Mikey! Good job! Thank you! I worked hard! Well, next up, you have to try and break out of my prison! Let's go! Now it's your turn, Mikey! Can you escape my terrible prison? This cell is fancy! Try to break out! I'm definitely getting out of here! First… Oh! There's a chest in here! What's inside? Oh! What is it? Snacks? Yep! Thanks! I was hungry! That's your first reward! In that case, I'll take it! Hmm? That's kind of suspicious! What? What's a sink doing in here? To wash your hands? Oops! It's no good! I'm stuck! It doesn't connect to anything! Wait! I figured it out! You did! The sewers! I bet you can escape through here! It even opens! That must be it! Yep! That's a toilet! Ew! Seriously? Don't jump into the toilet, Mikey! That's gross! Besides, it doesn't go anywhere! Sorry! Hmm… There's nothing suspicious about this bed, right? Nope! Nothing! Hmm… You're missing something! Oh! This? Hmm? Huh? Yep. What is it? Huh. It looks pretty important. What do you think? There's something up there. I could climb up, but how? Oh, you figured it out. Really? I can climb this? <laughs> yeah. Awesome. That was for you to climb up. Really? Wow. I had no idea. Whoa. Cool trick, right? Oops. You need to get up close when you open it. Otherwise, you won't fit inside. Huh? 
I see. Yep. Wow! I didn't know that! Now, Mikey, you successfully made it into the vents. This is a vent? Yeah. Awesome! Don't stop now. Can I escape through here? I'll try. It's so long! Good luck, Mikey! This looks suspicious. Is it okay to jump down there? It must be. There's nowhere else to go! You'll be fine. Ouch! Hmm? Take a look around. Whoa! That's where I started! Exactly! You broke out of the cell through that vent up there, but you're only getting started. Keep going. Okay, I'll do my best. This door looks weird. Can I open it? Sure. Okay, here I go. Open up! I'm breaking out of this joint. You can't lock me up forever. Oh, the floor is lava? It's a lava parkour course. I'm scared. Any mistake is fatal. <laughs> <laughs> True. Uh. One slip and it's over. Whoa, this is going well. Yeah. Hey, I made it to the top. That was awesome. Impressive. I'm glad I didn't fall. What's next? Hmm, nothing really. It's just a dead end, I guess. Well, why don't you start with opening the chest? Okay, three, two, one. Oh, look, there's a golden apple. Yeah. Okay. That's a prize for making it this far, Mikey. I gave you the apple because you're gonna need it. Now look over there. Up there? It's a dead end. No, Mikey, look very carefully. I know, it's an escape mechanism. Oh. Oh, of course. You figured it out. I get it. The golden apple boosts my health so my body can handle the... Wow! That was out of nowhere! You made it in one try! Awesome! You're doing really well! What's this? Your next test. Only one of these buttons is correct. Hmm. The wood, the iron, or the gold. There's only one right answer. Which one? Hmm, iron? Or is it... I feel like it might be gold. Oh, but maybe... Uh, it's probably wood. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. You've made your choice. Go ahead and push the button. Here I go. Three, two, one. Come on, what? Ah! What? Huh? No way. Oh, this is insane. Mikey, you're in trouble. So many zombies. you got to be kidding me. Where's the exit? How do I get out? I can't fight them all. Ah! Sorry. Wood was the wrong choice. The wood button was designed to be a trap. It's supposed to lock you in a room full of zombies that you can never escape from. Two options remain. Make sure you choose wisely. Golden iron. Well, I made my first choice because it felt safe. Yeah? This time, I'll choose something flashy and cool. I guess I'll go for the gold. Oh, okay. I'm breaking out of here. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh! What? Huh? What's going on in here? Wrong choice. Uh-oh! Mikey? Oh no! The TNT! <laughs> Whoa! Seriously? Sorry, gold wasn't right either. Obviously. Does that mean it's iron? I'll give it a try. Sure. If you say so. Is it really iron? <laughs> All right, I'm coming too. What is this? It's pulling me down. Where am I going? It's okay, Mikey. Just don't stop the bottom, okay? Why? Whoa, watch out! What? Book it! Run, Mikey! <gasps> You're doing great! Thanks! Keep going! It's right behind you! Run towards the big door, Mikey! Hurry up! What now? Go through the exit! <laughs> that zombie's too big! He can't fit through there! You're safe! Thought you could catch me, huh? Well, think again! You tell him, Mikey. Oh, a maze! Whoa! Cool! You did a really good job back there with the zombie. Now you just need to get through this maze and escape. This doesn't look too tough. Hmm, well, let's see. Oh. Here's the end. Huh? Already? Yep. Wow, that's it? Really? Mm-hmm. That was easy. You found the treasure at the end. Check it out. Sure. Three, two, one, open! Huh? Really? Are you sure I can have this? Wow! Look, it's an alien blaster rifle. Awesome! Okay, Mikey, the boss is just through those doors. Here I go. Hmm. Let's go inside. Oh. What? A clown? <laughs> Don't judge a book by its cover, Mikey. This clown is no joke. You're kidding. What am I supposed to do? Blast 
blast it with your crazy strong rifle. I'm doing it! Whoa, wow! Get him! Is it really working? Whoa! Huh? Really? I beat it? This rifle is so overpowered! Congratulations! The weapon may be powerful, but you were the one wielding it. This means you're a free man! Thanks for all your hard work! Hooray! Pull the lever. Three, two, one! Freedom! Nice! There's treasure too? Cool! That chest is your reward for finally breaking out of my prison. Aw, thank you! Let's see. Whoa! Awesome! Yeah? It's full of diamonds! Well, today, we both tried designing our own prison break challenges. Then we played through each other's prisons and we both successfully escaped. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to like and subscribe. Let's hang out again soon.